so good welcome back to this video i hope you're doing well today it's gonna be a special unboxing day because we are just approaching black friday and i've got seven or eight boxes to unbox and these are all interesting accessories and cameras so stick around until the end if you want to see the new gear i use to make videos it's going to be black friday big discounts so i'll leave the links down in the descriptions in case you want to check them out let's get the boxes are you ready you already know about this right i posted uh, a review on my blog check out projectgo.pro this is the creator edition and I wanted to unbox it with you so you can actually see what's inside the creator edition is quite interesting because it's got you know a few accessories bundled up that help action video makers make better videos especially you know if you want to make vlogs and tell your stories while you are around and maybe you are traveling or you are doing some action these mods help you quite a lot so that's why I'm gonna unbox this as well but first I want to show you what I got from Insta360 they sent me this camera a few days ago this is the Insta360 Ace Pro the new action camera co-engineered with Leica it's got AI built in so I'm very excited to test this out it came with multi-mount this is a kind of tripod that bends I couldn't figure out how to open the box it's actually <laughs> magnetic so that's that's it wow mm interesting it's a little bit heavy and large a bit larger than a gopro let's see what else do we get in the box this is the magnetic mount usb-c charging cable another mount all the stickers instructions that's what we get in the box let's check out the multi-mount oh, i like that it's a flexible mount it, it can become quite small i'm not sure how to open it again <laughs> come on man oh it's like that okay cool ah and with this setup i can basically get close to things i can follow people i can follow things and you know i can take a shot from low angle which it, which looks very cool so i like this actually so this is what was in the box of the Insta360 Ace. They do two versions, Ace and Ace Pro. This is the Pro version and in another video that I'm going to post around Black Friday. So like tomorrow, the day after tomorrow. So subscribe and stay tuned if you want to see the video while I test this action camera. Against the GoPro Hero 12, especially in night conditions. This camera has got a bigger lens, a bigger sensor, and it should be way better than all of the competitors during low light conditions. Insta360 just sent me the camera for free and they haven't sponsored the videos, but you know, I wanted to be transparent with you guys so you know how I work and what's going on with me and with my channel. So thank you very much Insta360 for sending over a camera so that I can test it and I can do many, many cool things with it. Thank you. So after the Insta360 Ace Pro, I think it's time for GoPro. So I got this Creator Edition. It's a bundle with all of the accessories that, you know, GoPro creators usually use. It's a smart tripod. It's got like you know buttons and controls to to control the camera um, it's got a battery as well like a backup battery so it's gonna charge your battery your gopro while you're filming so you got like, like more time and it's got like a light mod and a microphone a directional microphone which helps you know in like windy conditions and in different kind of conditions let's unbox it feels like christmas actually i wish i had all of these gadgets when i was a kid now when you grow up it's still cool but when you're a kid you're like whoop i can already see the light the media mod gopro hero 12 this is the, the tripod with the battery included i like that battery anything else no mm, this goes on the microphone it's the wind protector gopro mount a few cables generic mounts and that's it anyways if you want to read about the GoPro Hero 12, all the features, how it compares to the GoPro Hero 11 and 10, then go on my website, projectgo.pro, because I already made a few reviews 
a few comparisons, the links are down in the description if you want to see more technical specs and things like that. I just want to show you quickly, you know, side by side, how the two cameras look. The Insta360 Ace Pro is definitely heavier and a little bit bigger than the GoPro. They're both great action cameras, but depending on what you, what you do, then, you know, one is, would be better than the other, depending on the, on the use. But this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about more details about these two cameras in a future video, so stay tuned, subscribe, so that you don't miss any future videos. All right, what we get here, the Osmo Action 4. This is one of the other competitors. Actually, today we get the best three action cameras on the market that, you know, we have available today. And I'm very excited to, to unbox all of this goodness and show it to you guys. So let's see what we get inside the box. We get a selfie stick, which extends about like that. It feels quite solid. It's a good build. Then, okay, what we get here? How much plastic? Ooh, very small. I mean, compared to even the GoPro, look, it's very small. Okay, we can actually measure the weight. I mean, I've got it in grams, because right now I'm in Europe. Let's see, 113 grams, action four. Now, the GoPro Hero 12, 120 grams. So just a little bit heavier than the Action 4. And then Insta360 Ace Pro, 179 grams. So this is definitely heavier than the two. So yeah, if you wanna mount it, let's say on a FPV drone, surely you get a better chance with the Action 4 because it's way, it's way lighter and smaller. Then depending of course of the drone, you know how much weight it can lift, but if you wanna have something small and light then the action 4 is the one to go for what else do we get inside the box of the dji action 4 uh, instruction manuals how many times have you read an instruction manual i think it's one of those things that people don't use so much right i mean this is my experience i don't know what, what do you think do you read instruction manuals let, let me know down in the comments I, i'm always curious to see what other people do so let's see what this is it's like a charger oh yeah we get three batteries out of the box like that i mean yeah, this, this is like DJI signature, right? If you have a drone or a previous DJI action camera, you know that they come with these chargers and very solid material. It feels like very, very like solid and durable. Charging cable, different mounts. Here we get a little cage. This looks like the media mode from GoPro, but it hasn't got any electronics in it. It just, uh, it's just a cage. This is what we get inside the box of the DJI Action 4. I'm gonna leave, again, the link is down in the description if you wanna check it out. Then next, what do we get? You, Lanzi, send me this microphone. It's a wireless microphone. Right now I'm using a wireless microphone to record this video. This is, you know, like the one I've got here. It's a Rode Wireless, wireless Me. Oh my God. This came off anyways whatever and uh, I mean performs very good very well and this is my go-to microphone you know for almost every video but now I'm very excited and curious to test out this new wireless microphone I think it's quite similar to what DJI makes you know the DJI microphone the wireless microphone which is very good actually um, but it comes to a high price this Ulanzi should solve this price problem because this is a, a bit cheaper than the, the DJI and it looks quite similar from the outside. Now we have to test it and see if it sounds similar and if it, if it performs similar to the DJI. Out of the box we get transmitter receiver. It's already on. As soon as I open the box it turned on. The batteries are already charged. I can see these two signs which I think they indicate like they are, li they are linked. Cool, so I'm gonna test it soon on a different video, so stay tuned. Thank you very much, Yulanzi, for sending this over. I really appreciate it. This video, again, is not sponsored by anyone. It just, you know, I get some free stuff and I share it with you guys so that you can see what's available in the market today.
Next, from Yulanzi, I got another interesting accessory, which I think this is gonna interest you a lot if you make like YouTube videos or videos where you need to follow like a script. This is a teleprompter. Teleprompter, it's, I'm gonna show you. Let, let me open it. I thought it was like an LED light because it was like, it's, it's white, it's, yeah, whatever. Anyway, this is a teleprompter. This accessory allows you to read and look at the camera while you're reading. It's, it's pretty amazing, to be honest. It looks like you're looking at the camera while you're reading the script. Why? Because as you can see, this one has got a hole here. You insert the camera here, even a smartphone. And then what you do, you put another smartphone here, which is gonna reflect. Whatever you see on the screen of this smartphone is gonna reflect on this glass. In that way, you can read any script by looking at the camera. It's quite cheap, actually. <clears throat> It's available on Amazon. You can check out the link down in the description. Oh my God, there are two more to go. So stay with me. This is another microphone from Hollyland. Hollyland, <laughs> made to inspire. The box is it's very well done, I have to say. What? Oh, you probably attach the microphone on it, let's find out. It's quite heavy. Okay, I just opened it, it turns on, looks like the battery is full. It's similar to the one that I unboxed before. So it's got two mics, two wireless microphones, and this should have a battery bank inside to charge the microphones. They are very light. Yeah, I'm impressed because this one here that I'm using right now, it's, it's light, but it's, it's, it's heavier than these two, you know, together. That's why I'm noticing, you know, the, the, the weight, it's, it's, they are very light. And I like that because if you have to attach something like on yourself, you, you don't want to feel it. Like this, this mic, you definitely feel it. So I got it. This, basically, you can use it to put it on your, around your neck. It's magnetic. It's strong, actually, and you can just, you know, be cool with the new collar. <laughs> no, I like it, actually. Yeah, it's quite nice. And you can also um, clip it on your shirt like that. It's, just, it's actually way smaller than the than this one, the wireless me. Thank you very much, Hollyland. I really appreciate it. The price, it's around $249. Go and check it out if you're interested in this microphone. There should be a link and hopefully they are running a promotion during this Black Friday. So thanks again. Now let's move on to the other accessory that we got for this Black Friday. Ta -da -da -da. It's a light. It's a tabletop light by v Vigim. Vigim. Thank you very much for sending this over. I actually needed a, like this kind of light because I find myself traveling quite a lot recently. And when I go, you know, when I travel, I don't want to carry like a lot of weight, a lot of bags and a lot of accessories with me. So this is one of those things that, that are always needed. Whether you travel, whether you don't travel, you know, it's always good to have like compact gear that doesn't occupy much space. It's got like controls behind. Uh, you can dim the light and you can change the, the color temperature. Uh, oh. <laughs> and let's test it though. Let's see how much light this little thing can do. Uh, I need like a power bank for it. So I'm gonna use the GoPro grip. Yeah, like it's got this USB-C, it's got a power bank inside so it should be able to power the light i believe let's see hopefully work yes yay <laughs> nice so let's see it's very bright if it's very close to my face <laughs> this is the maximum light it can do and i can change the color temperature from the other control cool so I'm definitely gonna use this light, you know, when I'm out and about, but also at home, you know, I can just put it on the table and get rid of the other lights, like the one I've got behind, which is quite big. 
So I'm going to turn off that light so you can see what's the effect on my face if I just use one light, this one. You let me know in the comments because I actually cannot see what's going on in the screen now uh, as I'm recording the video. Go and check out these accessories on Amazon, but be careful because Black Friday is dangerous, right? Black Friday, yes, they, there are a lot of discounts, there are a lot of cool things and uh, shiny objects that attract me, attract you to buy, but don't focus on the gear because the gear is, yes, it's useful to create things. It's very exciting. It's like, you know, toys for adults, but we don't actually need so much gear in order to create amazing videos. Uh, what you need, what we need, is skills. I think skills are way more important than gear. That's why I really, um, I really, I say this all the time. Skills over gear. If you want to learn, if you want to improve your videos, if you want to improve your craft, make sure you improve your skills. You learn how to make, create better videos with the equipment that you already have. Better equipment can only, you know, improve uh, as much. But if you don't know how to to use the gear, then you can have, you know, the best camera in the world, but still make shitty videos. So for that, I created an online academy for GoPro video creators. It's called the GoPro Filmmakers Kit. It's where you can learn a lot of things about GoPro, how to use the GoPro to create amazing videos for your travels and adventure. So this Black Friday, I'm running a huge discount. So check it out. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next videos while I test and try all of this gear. I think the next video is gonna be about the Insta360 Ace Pro while I test it on low light and um, compare it with the GoPro. It's gonna be an interesting video, I believe, because this changes the game completely with the AI features, with the night amazing capabilities. Pfft crazy. Peace.